Welcome to Goodnight Robin, your someone to say goodnight to. I'm your host, Robin Rice. Today's episode is sponsored by Leslie Riley at Lead Like a Girl. Lead Like a Girl is redefining what it means to be a leader. They value collaboration over control, curiosity over certainty, compassion over criticism. The bravest thing you can be is yourself, and in doing so, inspire others to do the same. To find Leslie's TEDx talk and learn how you are an asset, see the link in our show notes or visit leadlikeagirl.com. So today was the day after Christmas. And the day after Christmas is very often one that has a lot of highs and lows. The response to all of the things, all of the work that you did, or maybe nothing that happened in your life. Maybe you saw other people having something happen and nothing really special happened for you. Whatever that story is, there's a buildup in the air. It's not just you. It's the whole world is like building up and building up and building up. And then the day after is whatever the fallout from that was. And it can be a more lonely day for people, I think. I do think it's, you know, if in fact you're dreading the holidays, then leading up to it can be the worst and you're glad when it's over. But if you did have a good time and did have things that you were doing with people and you were really enjoying it, but it didn't fully meet your expectations, then that can be hard too. So for that, for myself, this is what I do. I just remind myself that my emotions are weather systems. They're rainy or snowy or sunshiny or something in between. And that's not really my fault, my problem, something I need to control. I just need to notice it. And if it's a cold day, I put on a coat. And if it's a rainy day, I put on a, you know, wind slicker. What I do in response to it, yeah, that's that's up to me. But having those feelings are just totally normal. And what I find is that if I just sit with them and I just say, oh, well, this was really great. This disappointed me. I had hoped for more of this and less of that. And I'm kind of sad about that or whatever I'm feeling, maybe angry, who knows. And I treat it like a weather system and say, and tomorrow will be different because the weather always changes. If you notice, our emotions always change. You have different emotions on different days, different hours, different minutes. And so you just be with it and say, well, that's how it is today. I wanted to share that with you today because I think today's a very likely day that that day after Christmas or the day after something big that you were planning on, any day after something big, I think those are days where we can be emotionally a little more set up. So if today was challenging, if it was one of those days where, you know, the emotions ran high at different times, I just encourage you to look at the weather and say, yeah, the clouds are going to change. That's how it's going to be today, but it's not necessarily how it's going to be tomorrow. Anyway, that's what I tell myself on those days for me. I hope that helps somehow. That's what I have for you tonight. I'm thinking about you. Good night, my friends.